That's another concept that's kind of hard to grab right now. The playoffs no are eight games away. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's like we're in April and we're down the stretch we come, yet this is a, a, a preseason game. And Thanksgiving is a long time ago now. Yeah, they're a great fourth quarter team, have a great fourth quarter lineup. Ooh! Mm. To go against a guy like Steven Adams to get him ready for Embiid's of the world. There's a quick back throw cut. Uh, Easy two. Drive to the hoop. They can fill it up and they yeah. go at match mismatches. And Chris Paul, one of the better guys in the NBA at managing a game. Since uh, you mentioned it earlier, since the starter, 16 and 5 on this OKC team. There's Paul with a nice dish underneath, and Adams gets two. You feel that the Celtics championship hopes do you know, uh, hang on the thread of that knee. I, I do think that he needs to be healthy for the Celtics to get over the hump. Those guys get their rhythm, and they are tough to stop. Jordan again in the lane, and unable to convert with this. Adams is having a field day here early, 13-6. I'm glad that Coach Stevens or himself called his number to get that shot. Brown two for three to open the game. Going back inside to Adams, and again, it pays off. Drive it, kick it, drive it, dump it off to Tice down low. Oh, oh nice move. Good player, and the game shifted and really helped him with his skill and his size. Now he plays a power forward, and it's a great look. Ooh, nice play. Tice, like hanging with the Tice. Quick little steal by Smart for two. The hesitation move by Brown pulls up and knocks down the jumper. Smart and Tatum continue to get a lot of work here early going. Nice follow and two for Cameron. Kicks it back outside. Wanamaker passes up the jumper. He lost his footing, but managed to get it to Smart. Gets it back in the corner and knocks down a three. Shooter all the way to the basket, gets two. Faces up, backs his way down, gets in the paint. Unable to convert, good strong follow by Tice, kicks it back out. Oh, Ojale, Ojale. 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 that blow game. You can only count on the guys you came with, and I feel pretty good about these guys. They're pretty solid bunch, especially when they're all healthy like that. Corresponded with Brad a couple of times. He's, as you would expect with Brad, he's going to make the most out of the situation for everybody involved. Coverage starts at 5.30 with pregame live. It's all presented by TD Bank. Oh, what a play by Smart. Nice job. Celtics in the zone, and you got you to gotta see this. I don't think we'll see too many of these guys in the second half. Rebound slapped around. Adams comes up with it again with the big finish. Schroeder defending Smart. Smart takes it in the paint. Nice pass inside. And good finish by Tyson. Yeah, good job by Smart. Shooter had good defense, but Smart put that ball where uh, Stephen Adams couldn't get it. Gallinari misses outside. Another offensive board for Adams, who goes up and lays it in. Gilgis Alexander looking to take the ball to the basket, which he does very well. You know, Marcus thinks he's great at everything, which is probably... <laughs> He's not far well above average, yeah. Yeah, no question. They got a lot of good... I, I, I really like this team. I really like watching them play. Ball's going to take three shots in this game. Tatum in transition. Keeps on going to the basket and gets two. You know, all those calls to make this thing happen with Adam Silver, Michelle Roberts, he was on all these calls. He was working during quarantine. 51% shooting so far for OKC. Final seconds here, first half. That shot in the Asha? I mean, if, if they have Smart and Kemba, I, I, I don't know if that's going to happen. But if one of those guys is out, if Kemba is, is, is ailing with the knee or he... 
Green taking it hard to the basket and gets two. That's how you come off the screen and roll and just shut him down for eight to 12 minutes. I would think. Yeah, I mean, let's think about it. They lose quite Leonard and they're like right there knocking on the door. Ah. Ooh, nice shot. Gilgis Alexander just comes back the other way, hangs in the air, and gets two. Waters penetrates, gets in the paint, kicks it to the corner. Edwards passes up the shot, now gives it to Williams. And he gets two. on the baseline, rips his way through and gets two. Every possession defensively, can you move your feet? Do you have versatility offensively? What do you provide for your for your guys? A lot of stuff. Yeah. 67 viewers worth a lot of money too. He's got to improve his angles. Like a, Think of the opposite of Rob Williams would be a guy like Mark Gasol. Cantor for two. His whole life, and he's been able to block shots and erase all of his mistakes. You can't do that in the NBA. Canter, nice spot. Up a good pass from Edwards. Put that up in a crowd, got you. Want to make it against the kind bounce. You tend to forget about him a little bit, Scal. He's, he's a solid player. Yeah, I don't. I think in the playoffs, he's going to... One of the teammates, of, of one of the favorite teammates of the guys on OKC, works hard every single day. My having a bench like that when I played, sometimes I got kicked out. Somehow I think the courtside availability is not going to allow for that. <laughs> Cantor spins through traffic. He gets two. Do you think he addresses the defense? I think he does. Remember, I think coaches have this idea, man. This, we're not far away. Another turnover. Williams comes up with the loose ball. Oh, my gosh. Eventually, you, you have to be able. To, eventually, you have to be able to think your way through, you know, situations. Yeah, I, I think over the course of 82, you can get that, but that next level, that playoff level, it's it's everyone is playing hard at that point. Right? Yeah, well, we hope so. He just has different types of guys coming off the bench. Williams lost it, but Green managed to find it. Williams throws it up, and Williams throws it down. It's a good play by Grant. Just, first of all, he lost the ball, so he got it back. And then driving to the basket, knowing Rob Williams is right at the front of the rim, just throw it up. In a minute to go. That'll do it.